All right, here we are out on Big Winnie. This is that DeWalt 20 volt with that clam ice auger. They just sell you the auger on the bottom of the hand crank. We take that off, we put on the extension. Let's show them how we do this, Bunk. They say these are only good for shallow ice or thin ice, but we're in close to three feet of ice here on Big Winnie, and the key to this is clearing the hole about every six inches so it doesn't bind the auger. Look how far down. It's a good thing we bought the extension. Even way down there, he's getting ready to punch through. There we go. I'm gonna put four holes in. We've already marked the holes. But he's not pushing down at all on that auger. He's just letting the weight of the auger take it. And man, it just walks right down. Do not push down on the auger when you're drilling your holes. Just let it cut itself. It just wants to cut like butter. But you got to clear that hole of the snow about every six inches. There's another one. Two to go and we'll be fishing. Now for you guys that like to run and gun, I don't know how many holes. I've heard as high as 60 holes up to about a foot deep if you're fishing bluegill and crappie where you like to drill a, a hundred holes are all around the place. So I've got about three of them big thick DeWalt batteries. Keep them nice and toasty warm in the motel room charged up and man they look at that four three foot holes and it doesn't even begin to slow that battery down. But you got to clear the snow out every six inches. That is really, truly the key. If he just keeps going and stops, it'll roar, roar, roar. it'll it'll bind the auger head right up. Oop. See, it almost wanted to catch there. It almost wanted to catch there. There we go. Now we're going to back our ice castle fish house here, back over the top of the holes, and get fishing. So here we are and. Big Winnebagosh getting ready to pound some perch this morning. Let's see how she works. Steve Hall from Nashville, Tennessee. I hope that's been helpful. Those guys thinking about buying one of them.